New at noon, two sea turtles were returning to Florida waters today after completing rehab at Miami Aquarium. The reptiles were rescued back in 2019 and last year. And local 10 News reporter Annalise Garcia is live in Key Biscayne for us. She tell us about the sea turtles road to recovery. Annalise. Good afternoon, ladies. Well, this is a really exciting day here in Key Biscayne. They were able to release two turtles that were with them for over a year. They spoke to us briefly about some of the problems they came in with. These two male sea turtles released back into the ocean today. The larger of the two, a loggerhead, is Yule. He was rescued from Black Point Marina in December 2019. He came in with hooks, like fishing hooks, all throughout his body. Uh, so we counted at least five in the x-ray photos that were internal. He also had a few external hooks which were easier to remove. One hook specifically got um, kind of hooked on his esophagus. Uh, so we did, it did require surgery to get that one removed. The smaller one is a green sea turtle, Boyance, named after the issues he had when he came in. He was rescued from North Bay Village in September 2020. He had um, some kind of weird buoyancy issues, so floating with his back end um, up at the water, kind of bobbing around. Um, and in that case, it was from impaction. Julie Hyde, part of the team who took care of the two, tells us this year alone they've rescued at least 12 sea turtles. You know, when we're able to get them fully recovered from their injuries and get them back out into the wild, it's just so rewarding for the team. We know we put a lot of hard work into them, so um, it's this is where, you know, we want them to be is back out in the wild. Now, as for those 12 turtles rescued, Hyde tells me that they came in pretty lethargic and skinny, so it's going to take some time for them to rehabilitate and be sent back into the waters. I'm reporting live on Key Biscayne, Annalise Garcia, Local 10 News.